Hi guys, what you see here is a ceramic stain tray. This has 20 wells for mixing your paints or stains. It has a glossed glaze finish here. And you can see the big crack here that uh, it has in the middle. That happened a little while back and so ever since then I've been thinking about making another tray. Um, I bought this one uh, years ago, used it a long time, and so uh, the other day I made a mold out of plaster. Let me show you that mold. And here's a look at that mold that I made. Now this one has eight wells, and I made a little mixing area here in the center. What I'll be doing is pouring wet or uh, slip clay into this and once that clay dries um, I'll be putting this in a kiln and then uh, eventually glazing it and hopefully getting a uh, nice smooth glaze look like the old one here so let's go ahead and get started on this today guys Here's a look at the stain tray now. It's been about 48 hours since I pulled it from the plaster mold. You can see that it's a light gray color. It's dried out now and would be okay for a bisque firing. Uh, before I do that though, I want to make some adjustments to the tray. If I uh, fire the tray like it is here, it's going to have sharp uh, edges and corners, as you can see here, and the glaze would not adhere to that very well. So before I um, bisque fire it. I'm going to smooth out these edges, corners. I'm going to re-wet the clay here and use my finger and just round off any sharp areas uh, like the top of these wells here. Smooth out this little area here uh, as well as fill in this bubble that you see here with some wet clay. So I'm going to use my finger um, and re-wet the uh, tray for that. So let's go ahead and do that now.
Here's a look at the tray after the bisque bake. The next thing I'll be doing is glazing the tray. And I'm going to be using the Series 2000 Gloss Cloud White. I'll be applying three uniform coats with those coats of glaze dry and then fire to cone 06. Thank you. 